September is National Addiction Recovery Month. So Two Cares of the Community is trying to raise awareness about both addiction and recovery right here in Oklahoma with a series of stories sponsored by Valley Hope of Cushing Addiction Treatment and Recovery. Whether it's you or someone you know, there is help to get life back on track. Unpacking from a move is never easy, especially for a single dad who works to stay sober every day. I was a blackout drinker starting about sophomore year. Alcohol was the starting point to addiction for Jeff, as it is for many people. I, I got into the party scene. I started making good money. Um, a friend of mine introduced me to cocaine and everything just blew up from there. He isn't alone. The Oklahoma Department of Mental Health and Substance Abuse Services says 250 to 300,000 Oklahomans are fighting substance abuse disorder. I'm an alcoholic first and foremost, um, but I've, I've gotten into pain pills before because of surgeries. I've gotten into um, Adderall, methamphetamine, uh, bath salts. His family sent him to Valley Hope Treatment Center in Cushing. Most of the folks who come from us are, you know, average people living um, in their lives. They have families, they have jobs. You know, they're just going through a difficult period and we're there to support them. Senior Vice President Dana Kearney says Valley Hope offers a continuum of care, starting with residential treatment and medical stabilization to help with detox. Which is where we're able to bring people in um, at any stage of their use and treat them with the medical tools necessary to stabilize them and keep them safe. We have medications that are available to make their withdrawal symptoms as comfortable as possible. There are nurses on staff and support 24 seven. We have um, therapists, um, our counselors, our clinical team, master level therapists who work with patients one on one, who also work with them in a group therapy setting. They offer intense therapy, inpatient and intensive outpatient programs, as well as support when returning home. We know that a life of recovery has an impact on not only the individual, their family, their workplace and their community as a whole. And so we're really trying to fight the stigma of substance use disorder and also um, let people know that addiction does not have to be a death sentence and that hope is available for them. There are warning signs to watch for lifestyle changes, isolating, job or family issues. The minute you have a question or any kind of concern, whatever that is, don't wait for the next sign. Reach out and talk to a professional and let them help you guide or help guide you, you through this. It hasn't been easy for Jeff. He's relapsed several times, but has been living clean and sober for more than five years. And for those battling addiction now. I always say the same thing. Pick up your phone and, and call somebody. Tell, talk to somebody. Don't keep it a secret. And Jeff now helps other single dads in recovery by organizing support group meetings. For more information on treatment programs at Valley Hope, look for the link in this story on our website, kjrh.com.